Hello, Richard Gallagher is my name. I'm a head and neck surgeon, and I mainly look after patients with cancers of the head and neck. So let's go ahead and have a look at this patient's mouth. So when I examine the mouth, uh, the first thing I do is just ask the patient to open their mouth. Okay, and just have a general look. Have a look at the lips, make sure that there's no evidence of any problems with the lip. Can you just poke your tongue out for me? Thanks, but and just move your tongue from side to side for me. So I just have a look and just make sure that the tongue movement's normal as the first thing that we do. I can have a look at the buccal mucosa and systematically look at that and look in the gingiva buccal groove, so that space between the teeth uh, and the uh, gingiva uh, and jaws and the buccal mucosa and work my way around. You can do that around the front, have a look in the gingiva buccal groove, then around to the right hand side and again you can get a great view and you can do it all the way around it really gives you a fantastic light so the last or not the last area but the next area to look at is just look at the top of the palate here now I'm just going to get Brett here to just breathe in and out through the mouth for me and I'm going to depress his tongue and have a look at the back of the throat and I can see his uvula I can see the whole of the soft palate I can see his tonsil tissue and it really gives me a great view. And I can see that his tonsils aren't enlarged and that the back of his throat's healthy. And then usually what I do is grab a glove and a gauze square. Just poke your tongue right out for me. So I just grab the tongue and then I can have a look at the side of the tongue, right down the side of the tongue, the bottom of the mouth at the front here. And then we can change that over and have a look at the other side like that, have a look at the floor of the mouth. So you can change from hand to hand. Then after we've done that, we have a look at the back of the mouth. So just breathe in and out through the mouth for me. And we can see the uvula and we can see the soft palate, the tonsils on both sides. He has small tonsils. You can see what we call the tonsil of uh, pillars, the anterior and posterior pillar and the back wall of the oropharynx. And then also just to have a look at the top of the mouth, we just shine here and have a look at the roof of the mouth, at the hard palate area, mucosa, and back down to the soft palate. And then that's the end of the examination.